Hello and welcome to 416 Greenport Drive, West Carrollton, Ohio. Here around the driveway, walking up to the front, as you can see, we have a new approach here. Could put a widen your driveway over here if you wanted to. Uh, pretty much full brick home, just with a few exceptions, like right here. Two car garage here. That's a decorative door. And these steps and call this concrete does not look very old. All of the windows have been updated. Guys, this home was completely updated just a couple years ago, and more updates have been done since then. Before we go inside, let's go out in the backyard and take a look, because it is awesome back there. I'll meet you out there. All right, so here I just came out the back door, and we're standing on a good-sized deck here, and this is all composite decking, and looks like a like PVC handrail, so should last a very good long time here. Fully fenced in backyard, owners have fenced it. There is a gate back there to kind of go to the ravine if you wanted to do some hiking. The shed stays, the swing set stays, and the yard is fully fenced. And check out this uh, patio here. This is very thick concrete, and it is a massive, massive patio here. I uh, did have a basketball hoop out here at one time, and there's also concrete underneath here. And we're just gonna walk down and check that out as well. Stairs here are all composite as well. But talk about additional storage. Now I'm about 6'3", and this comes up to about eye level. So be good storage or maybe a play area for the kids. And again, you can see how thick this concrete is. This is a big pad. And I think this is just like a year or two old, not very old. But again, fully fenced yard. And everything here stays. And this is a full brick home also. Next, let's go inside and take a look. All right, so here I just came through the front door. You can go up or down. I came up, obviously. Beautiful handrail here with uh, wrought, wrought iron look spindles. Those are actually pretty heavy duty. Those are not fake. And very much a great room up here. Living room and a big window, pitcher window here, crank outs on either side, and then three pitcher windows underneath, so a lot of natural light comes in there. Have the accent wall here for the dining room, and a big bar. I guess that's not a bar, I guess that's an island, but it's got the bar top on it, so you definitely could put some bar stools right there. As you can see, we have plenty of room for bar stools. And guys, all of the stainless steel appliances here stay. Whirlpool fridge, Whirlpool range, Whirlpool microwave, and a Whirlpool dishwasher, so everything matches. Tile backsplash, and I use some of this same backsplash in my house. I love this stuff, it kinda has a stainless steel look to it. Big double bowl sink that overlooks the backyard. So while you're doing dishes, you can see the kids and or dogs running and playing. Coat closet right here to our right. This is being used as a pantry closet. Could be a linen closet as well, but we also have a linen closet over there. So hence the pantry closet. Bedroom number one. This is in the front middle of the home. Big double sliding closet doors here. Now, guys, none of the curtains stay, but the curtain rods and holders uh, do stay. Uh, looks like a Harbor, for, Harbor Breeze ceiling fan in there. Bathroom number one. Plenty of countertop space. Got a high efficiency toilet. And this tile flows into the shower as well. And this is a jetted tub here. All of the doors trim have been updated. All of the flooring has been updated. There's that linen closet I was telling you about. Bedroom number two, and I might have these labeled differently um, size-wise, I don't know which I'm calling one or two, but this is the second one that we've came to. Ceiling fan in here as well, which really helps cut down on energy bills, as you know. Uh, all the windows here updated. And if I peek around the corner, two big double sliding closets here as well. This is uh, not real wide, but a pretty good length on this bedroom. And this is what we would call the owner suite here. Obviously can accommodate a king size bed and room to spare. Harbor breeze ceiling fan in here as well. Sconce lights on either side do stay. And a big double sliding closet here as well. 
and adjoining bathroom, ceramic tile floor. It's all looks like porcelain tile, walk-in shower here, and a high efficiency toilet in here. And again, everything in here for the most part is just a couple years old as well. So that's the first floor. Next, we're going to go back to where we started. This is a really nice feel. When you walk in here, it's a really nice feel. But I'm gonna go down there and then I'll meet you downstairs. All right, so here I just came down the stairs. Immediately to our left is the entrance to our two-car garage. And this is a big two-car garage and there is a storage um, shelf in there. So there's, can park the cars in there and still have plenty of storage. Our laundry room here slash mechanical room. Uh, water heater is only like a year old here. This is an electric water heater. And then our high efficiency furnace is not that old either. Washer and dryer do not stay, but this is where they would be. And this is very clean and very nice here. Obviously you could put plenty of shelves in there. Underneath the stair storage, so this closet goes a good ways back here. Opens up into our family room. Now this does have a fireplace, but the current owners have never used it. You know, previous owner never used it, so not warranted. Could work, could not work, but we have no idea on that fireplace. Um, there are a few things like this desk. This was a desk that the owner built for their kids. They're gonna take this with them. So this will not stay. So you have plenty of room to put your pool table in here, your ping pong table in here. And again, all the windows are new. And that window overlooks the deck, uh, under the deck here, that concrete patio. Of course, my I had a brain fart because I'm like, well, you could have a, a bar right here and serve out the window. <laughs> Sorry, squirrel. So very, very nice. Carpet's very soft. No negative smell to this home. Just a great, great house. Next, I'll meet you upstairs for a few closing statements. So thanks for watching our video. If you have any questions about this home or if you'd like to see it in person, feel free to give me a call or give your realtor a call. I'm sure they'd be happy to show it to you. A house of this caliber, this location, the backyard, two, three entertaining areas plus your backyard. This is just a great place to call home. So act fast because again, home like this does not last long. Oh, and these blinds are in the glass there, so you don't have to clean those. But I'll finish with the back composite decking, the fenced in yard, very private, very tranquil setting, and a ginormous concrete patio. Thanks for watching, everybody.